So when I'm working with my horses about getting better, about to be off my legs and my hands, what, I, what I'm looking for, and I was talking to a friend of mine, Jill Barron, here the other day too, and I said like, I've kind of, I want to have it to where it's probably like 75% feet and seat and 25% and hands, and she thought to where, where she, did, she does Western equitation, which is sort of a form of Western dressage, uh, she thought maybe even more, maybe even like 80% where it would be your feet and your seat that your horses operate on and then your hands support your legs. So when, I, when I'm working this mare, I'm always thinking about everything that I want my horse to do, I want them to be in a soft field. So if I had my horse to where I walked him across and he was straight as an arrow as I wanted him to be and I picked up on my reins, and he pushed on my hands, well, I wouldn't be happy with that because he pushed on me in the stall. So whether it be my hands or my legs, I don't want them to be pushing on me. And what happens quite often when you're working on getting your horses better about your legs. So I, I'm having a soft feel here on, on this mare, and she's, she's decent about giving it to me. But then what happens sometimes here is if I put a leg on her to do a little leg yield, what she's doing is she starts pushing on my hands. And, and that's something that, that is very common because the pressure that I'm putting on with my leg is coming out through her mouth. She's pushing on my hands because of my leg. What I want to do is I'm gonna work her to a point that that resistance isn't there. The soft feel doesn't change. And it takes just hanging in there to where everything I do, there I'm gonna put a little bit of leg on her if the camera's watching here right now. And she's pushing a little bit on my hands and I'm gonna go back to where I'm getting her soft again with my hands. I'm maintaining it. And she should be able to maintain this headset and this softness indefinitely with me just releasing her with my hand. If you just watch my hand here, I just open the door. So now I'm gonna leg yield away from the camera a little bit. See her head's pushing up a little bit? So the pressure that I'm applying with my leg is kind of coming out through my reins. So I'm just gonna hang in there and get her soft about it. My goal will be, and this mare tells me the way, she, the way she responds, it won't be very long, that when I put a leg on her, I'm gonna get what I'm asking for and she won't be pushing on my hands. That's my goal, to where the resistance on my reins doesn't change a bit, no matter what I'm doing with my leg yields.